okay good morning guys uh, and uh, hope you are doing well so in this today's video we are going to discuss one of the best uh, topic that you seriously need to work on your discipline that why discipline is more important than your strategy even after having some of the best strategy the traders will going to lose the money in the market i will give you the perfect example even i am a human being uh, even i do make a mistakes then how do i correct myself to not uh, lose more to risk only few percent of this target uh, sorry party profit uh, sorry <laughs> stop loss and uh, we'll, we'll <clears throat> execute how to uh, we can make some of the biggest profits you can learn it from the mistake and please don't repeat these mistakes in your trading style so hope this video will going to give you some insights that how order flow works and how we initiated our trades and what are the mistakes we have done as well as how you can uh, learn the things that you should not do those mistakes in your trading life so let's begin so on on i think on tuesday i have initiated or not on the tuesday on the wednesday i have initiated some of the trades on the nasdaq so i took some short position i will show you some of these uh, trade histories well maximize this thing right i hope you can clearly see somewhat here i have initiated one a uh, short position that before knowing the market will going to give you the momentum that's the particular entry i took here so order flow will give you some proper inside idea that how does or where does this momentum will going to occur so based on that we can easily take our proper entries so i took a four lot of a short entry at this price around uh, 20791 uh, and around almost at 81 i have closed my uh, the take profit because uh, i have just expected only 10 points of a uh, take profit I, uh, even although the market has gone below that but i was happy with my take profit has been hit so after that so see obviously everybody have their own hunger of feeding uh, their tummies as well as i have my own hunger uh, to book only 15 points in nasdaq okay so it's it's not more uh, just a 15 points i have already booked the 10 points then only 5 points remain so when this 5 points remain so what i thought that so let's take some trades and uh, let's make a 5 points in the market so i took all these entries <laughs> okay so i took all these entries these entries are not based on my any strategies and nothing is working here so simply i was initiating a trade just expecting to however market will give me a five points and i will exit from the market so i have that kind of a mentality when i have initiated this trade so but look at here so whatever the profit i have made from this trade i have lost all my money okay so 800 dollar profit has turned into the zero so again um, again i i have waited some proper um, uh, opportunities so i thought i decided that okay are yeah, this is this, if this is happening then we cannot execute our trades properly because these entries were uh, initiated by using some of the scalping trades those scalping trades risk risk to reward should be one risk to one i i don't go further one risk to one uh, for risk reward for a scalping but i was expecting the risk reward should be higher in a scalping strategies so that is the biggest mistake i have done so if you look into here this is where i made a entry so one risk to one has been given i could have take this i could have closed my position but i was expecting to market to come somewhat here so rather than taking my take profit i have took my the trailed break even a uh, stop loss again again the market has given upside move again here i took some of these sell trades i hope you can see this trade history uh, where it's clearly is showing my the entry somewhat here again somewhat here my trail stop loss has been hit so these two trades what happens so whatever the profit i have made some half of the uh, the profit has been wiped out here and few uh, uh, profit has been wiped out here so again there is a no emotion that there is a not at a zero emotion because because i am taking a risk on my morning trade profits so these kind of and things you seriously need to work so after feeling all these things and i i have decided that okay if if something is like happening like this then this is a not a useful because again the same mistake i am making those 
all those 90 percent of the people are making so i have took the decision that i will sit properly i will wait for a proper opportunity and i will take my uh, trade then i have initiated this trade this simple trade i have initiated at 20797 and uh, closed at 20816 done around some 20 points or uh, around some around 20 points i have take profit i have done it here and whatever the the hunger of booking these points at ended here so what you learned from this entire video that i seriously need to tell you that so always you should know your strategy how it works what is the risk ratio or reward ratio you should expect from that and what kind of a strategy you have what is the really higher time frame is doing so never trade opposite of your trade because so whenever i trade um because uh, so sorry whenever i try, try to trade initiate my trade opposite of the trend i will not expect risk risk to reward as much a bigger uh, risk risk to reward i will not expect i will expect only one risk to one to one risk to two maximum not more than that so when i was trading with the trade then i will expect the my risk risk to reward is more than one risk to three so these kind of an information that you should really know before initiating trade what really happened there and why you are uh, why you are initiating your trades where is your stop loss where is your take profit and seriously just uh, don't show your aggressiveness or don't show that if somewhat here i have entered in the market and i'm expecting a, a, a very fewer points and i will exit from the market if you have a, that kind of a mentality then try to find some of the high probability trades initiate your trades only based on those entries not on each and every candle don't try to initiate because i hope the result is in front of you that whatever the profit which i have made due to these silly mistakes i have uh, lost all my profit around the morning profit i have lost it again i have recorded it from this trade so this is a simple example that you should need to learn that how your strategy works how disciplined you should be because there are some strategy which I follow that until and unless these patterns, these things, these key levels will not go into test, I'm not going to initiate any trade in the market. So that kind of a discipline you should follow, then only you will get some of the best results. Okay. So I hope you got the idea that why sometime, not only sometime, uh, most of the time discipline is more important than your strategies. So hope this video will have given us some insights that what really uh, we made a mistake and don't repeat those mistakes in your trading life to uh, not to lose the money in the market. I hope you got some idea uh, about the today's topic video. We'll see you in the next topic. Uh, have a happy trading. Thank you.